Hello, my name is Lee Ortmann and I'm a PhD candidate at the University of Luxembourg. Today I'm going to present the first results from our laboratory study investigating the short-term effects of social exclusion on need satisfaction and mood. The COVID-19 pandemic and the associated social distancing measures have created a situation worldwide in which people felt socially isolated from each other. Social isolation has been associated with a range of physical and mental health outcomes, such as depressive symptoms and anxiety. The short-term effects are, however, unclear. The aim of the current study was therefore to investigate the short-term effects of social exclusion on need satisfaction and mood in a controlled laboratory study. 32 healthy participants took part in our laboratory study. They played two rounds of a virtual ball tossing game, the so-called cyberball paradigm, which is used in research to induce feelings of social inclusion and exclusion. In one block, participants were included by their co-players, and the second block, participants were excluded by their co-players. Following each block, participants provided ratings on need satisfaction and mood. First, the cyberball paradigm was effective in inducing feelings of social exclusion in our study. This is inferred from the fact that participants felt significantly more ignored and excluded by their co-players in the exclusion condition than in the inclusion condition. Furthermore, the estimates were consistent with the actual percentage of ball received. In terms of short-term effects on need satisfaction and mood, the pattern of results was also clear. Following the exclusion condition, participants' fundamental needs, including belonging, self-esteem, meaningful existence and control, were severely threatened. Participants' mood also changed accordingly. Following the exclusion condition, positive emotions were rated as less important, whereas negative emotions were perceived as more intense. These findings suggest that social exclusion, even over a short period of time, threatens fundamental needs and increases negative mood. It is therefore plausible to assume that repeated exposure to social exclusion may lead to impairment of mental health in the long run.